Pacers hosting the Nets. The Nets are two and a half or three point favorites. The over under is at 235 and a half. The Nets are minus 155 on the money line. The Pacers are plus 130. The Nets are on a one game winning streak. The Pacers are on a one game losing streak. The Nets are eight, 10 and one against the spread this year. And the under is 11 and eight in the games in which they played in. They are five and six on the road this year. The Pacers are 11 and six against the spread this year. The under is nine and eight in the games in which they played in. And they are six and four at home this year. Head to head, the Nets are eight and two in their last 10 meetings against the Pacers. The underdog has covered the last five games that they've played against each other. The underdog is nine and one against the spread. The favorite is five and five on the money line. Mind you, a lot of these games got played when Kyrie wasn't playing, so keep that in mind. The over-under is 5-5. Five and five. The over-under at 235.5 is also 5-5. Five and five. And the road team is 6-4 and four in their last 10 meetings. The last game that they played, the Nets won 116-109. to 109. The Pacers were 8-point uh, underdogs. The game before that, the Pacers won 125-116. to 116. They were 11-point underdogs. The game before that, the Nets won 134 to 126, and the Pacers were 16 and a half point underdogs. The Pacers covered in all of those games because the Nets didn't cover the spread. I'm going to take Brooklyn with the money line. I am going to take Brooklyn laying the points, and I'm going to go. I'm going to go under in this game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.